There you are, bodyguard. It's um, rather boisterous around the tavern at the moment. The commotion woke me up. Well, that's not exactly true. One of my servants woke me up. I was having this dream. In any case, it seems that there is some uh, event today. Oh, a human festival. I see. And I assume I am supposed to attend. No, I don't object. As long as I have you to um, protect me. Yes. I mean, of course, I... I always feel safer when you're around. Huh? I mean that in the most... professional sense, of course. Um, uh, forgive me for staring at your eyes so much. Hey. Well, they're such a different color to anything I see in my kingdom. I suppose humans have different shades compared to my own. What do you think of my eyes? Uh, <clears throat> yes, no, uh, absolutely, you're correct. We should uh, venture forth and perhaps... Um, procure some um, local foods and watch some of the festivities. <sighs> no, uh, forgive me for staring so much. I have just been going over some things in my mind. I, um, yes, uh, let, let us go. Yes. What? It certainly is busy here. It seems as if... Well... I'm not sure. It seems as if the whole thing is... kind of... uproarious. These are far removed from the festivities back in my isle. Yes, my family hold royal galas and such. I was allowed to attend, of course, but never to dance or anything of that like. Although, the footwork of your people is something I would struggle to emulate. <sighs> no. Centaur, do not dance. Uh, mm, perhaps another time. Do you know that person? Mm. The one over there? He just forcefully knocked into you. Ah. Some sort of vagabond from your past. Oh, I see. Well then. Perhaps it's best if I claim him with steel. Yes. I will challenge him to a duel for your honor. And cut him down where he's... Huh? S sorry? It's not seen as... Oh. <clears throat> Forgive me, I suppose I am unaware of your customs. I just mean... Not that I am attempting to defend your honor, we are not like in those ways. No, I understand your job as the bodyguard. I, I just... It, it's a gesture of affection to defend another's honor in a duel. Um... Well... It is my upstanding duty to uphold the rules and laws of the land. And so if you claim to me that it is... 
against your ways to engage in combat with street urchins like that. He, um, and you and he, I mean, you don't have a past, do you? I mean, I know you have a past, but I mean, by that, of course, what I, <clears throat> um, but, uh, I would hate to think that I would have to cut down several. <sighs> Sorry, I'm thinking out loud again. Yes, uh, festivities. Yes. Um, you can show me to one of these fine purveyors of, uh, human delicacy. Uh, what is it that humans usually eat? Oh, I see. So you have a line of... Hmm. What festival is this? Festival of Rebirth. I've never heard of such a thing back on my isle. Mm, perchance, what was it um, in aid of? Oh, the rebuilding of the earth in the image of your people. It's quite uppity. Hmm? N nothing. <laughs> well, what's your favorite dish? I beg your pardon? F fries. Um, I'm unsure if I'm able to eat those. What are they exactly? Okay. Follow-up question. What is a potato? Uh, well, I do understand vegetables, so that's, um, yes, that makes sense. Uh, excuse me, vendor. I would like, um, one fry, please. Huh? The, oh, uh, Maybe you should take over. What's a bag of them? Just, uh... <laughs> oh my. <laughs> you say your people invented these? <laughs> These are amazing. <sighs> well, thank you for this wonderful day, day, day out. <clears throat> I am, I am thoroughly enjoying my. Wait a moment. It's a. It's a human book dealer. <gasps> I actually. All these romance novels. I um, sent scouts to this isle before I came to learn about your history and they brought back all these wonderful books. Tales of the Stable, issue 14. Uh, I never got this one. The Desert Vengeance. Two star-crossed lovers from kingdoms apart. This is where I learned about all your history. About your princesses scooped up in the arms of farm boys and about your noble dukes being betrothed to one and then falling for another. Um, Evenda, I'll take, I'll take everything, all of them. Uh, oh my, um, oh, uh, <clears throat> I uh, require these books for educational purposes to bring back to my land. Yes. <clears throat> I look like an idiot. Well, bodyguard, um, why don't they uh, pack up my purchases for me? 
I wish to um, talk to you about something perhaps maybe slightly more personal. I mean, well, <clears throat> that is to say, uh, would you like a f fry? Well, I, um, I have begun to feel a certain way about about you and if I could I mean I've, we've discussed this I know um, but if you would just consider maybe coming back to my my land and maybe staying with me as my forever bodyguard Would that be something you'd be interested in? Mm. Yes, I mean, by that I... I... No, no, I, I understand that you're just a hired contract, but don't you feel something else? Do you, you understand what I mean? Don't you feel something more? More, um... <clears throat> Never mind, I'm being foolish. Would you, uh, be so kind as to go get the books for me? My hands are full. <sighs> You're going to be mine. Yes. I don't care how long it takes. I'm going to make sure that we're together. My darling. It's like all those romance books says. You need to fight for love. Even if love might not blossom just yet. You have to force it. Well, Make sure fate knows which way to swing. Huh? Huh? Oh, you're back with the books. Great. Let's go back to the tavern. <laughs> Artwork for this video was by Sam. Thank you.